obviously I felt I feel very good. You know, uh, I felt I felt that I was flying out there today. And uh, the the other night uh, when we played the game was was kind of tough, but uh, in Milwaukee. But I was still trying my best, and I think um, you know I feel comfortable as I felt before I left. And now it's uh, the goals just. Just came today and was uh, you know I was so so glad that I could score on the team. Was it a relief? Yeah, actually it was. You know I, I couldn't score many games, so now just like uh, finally came and uh, and I could score. So it was uh, it was pretty good. I was a pretty good feeling again to you know to feel that I can score again. So uh, yeah, it was good. Can you explain why you scored? If you're gonna score one goal, you scored two goals. <laughs> I don't know. It's probably. I don't know, probably I can't, I, I can't score a hat-trick, I guess, so uh, maybe maybe the, uh, later of the season, but I don't know, I just, I feel when I score the first goal, I just I just feel good, and I just keep going, and, and uh, just, just, I don't know, I just felt it at the second, that I could score the second goal, and I scored it, so it was, uh, it was a good feeling. Yeah, it looked like you were really desperate trying to get that third one. In yeah, time. obviously it would, be, it would be pretty cool, you know, to score a hat-trick as a, as a first year as a, as a pro, so uh, like a rookie, so it would, be, it would be awesome, but, you know, I got away for it, and, and uh, yeah, well, I mean, it was a good game, unfortunately we lost, because, you know, we didn't, we didn't score in overtime, and then, and then we then we didn't score in the line shit as well, so, yeah, it's probably our fault. Despite not having the <coughs> excuse me World Junior that you were hoping for, are there any positives you can take away from that experience? Oh, uh, I don't know. It's up to say it's because uh, it wasn't step back, but it was step kind of like a, it was a side step because I wanted to play to uh, like a junior hockey again. But uh, I went there because I, you know, I just wanted to play there for for the national team. And I don't know if I can take something from it, but. Uh, I mean, anyway, it was a good experience for me to, you know, to play there for my uh, for my country again. But uh, I mean, uh, it's it's way different, uh, st like a type of the game. So I mean, uh, probably maybe a little bit something, but I don't think so. Do you feel like maybe you were honed in on, you know, being a high draft pick that you were? Do you think guys were kind of cluing in on you and knew where you were on the ice there? Oh, uh, I mean today? No, at the, 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 the tournament. Yeah. Uh, no, I mean, you know, uh, yeah, always I was, you know. <laughs> Six overall, but it, it means nothing right now. It just I was just drafted to Detroit right now when I'm playing playing here, and uh, probably they were expecting something uh, something more more from you know for myself that I can score or something, but I I didn't. But just it's it's gone, and, and now I just just want to focus on uh, on Griffin's hockey right now. Did it feel like the competition was tougher this time around? Or? I was uh, it's hockey, you know. It's one year I had a like unbelievable year. I, I scored like every time that I when I had a chance, and now I just you know I had many many times to post, and I just I just couldn't score. But I was trying to compete for the team, you know, play a different type of the game, and and you know I, as I said, it's gone. And just want to be focused for for uh, uh, here in the Rapids, and and we'll see what's gonna happen later this season. It was a big confidence boost tonight. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel, I feel. As I said, I feel very good. So it was, it was a huge, huge confidence in my head for, for the next game. So I just, you know, I just gotta keep going like this, and you know, skate hard, and, and play hard, and play for a team. Make sure you uh, thank Chelios for that pass. Yeah, obviously, it was, it was a pretty nice pass. You know, I was there open, and he saw me, and it was a, it was a seam pass. It was, uh, it was kind of hard to, to hit it, but it was, it was a clear pass on the ice. So it was, uh, it was, it was good. It was, it was pretty good pass. Yeah. Can I track yeah, I thought he was. Uh, I thought he was dangerous all night. I thought he came back. You know, you never know with the. Uh, it's a different style of hockey in that World Junior Championship. So, uh, I thought he came back and he was a threat all night and uh, was pretty responsible defensively. So, encouraging for for us to see him you know, come back and you know, get assimilated back to our team quickly. Uh, how'd you decide who was shooting for uh, in the shootout? Well, we've got all the stats and everything to. Uh, to kind of support who we're going with, but I mean, you're going with guys that you feel are having good games, or maybe have a good feel for the puck. Who's been playing a lot, so uh, you know, it's tough to win a shootout game when you don't score a goal. So uh, and that's always a gamble when you get to shootout. So it's, it's a, you know based on a little bit of a background history and also who's having a good game. I, I ask because uh, yeah. where Sedino was, I don't know where else you put him anyway. But I'm just, yeah. Well, you know, what do you think about that? Well, the thought process is if you know we don't score, I don't want to put him in a situation uh, where he's feels that pressure, and then all of a sudden maybe he doesn't score that pressure, or he doesn't have success, then all of a sudden his confidence goes down. So you have to kind of worry about that a lot too. 
um, in that tournament, I mean, he didn't have the tournament he wanted, obviously. Those can be a crapshoot where you're only playing a couple games and there's a lot of luck involved. Is it still disheartening to see him not perform as well as he could have? Or? Well, again, I'm not going to say I didn't see enough of the, I'm talking about the World Juniors. Mm -hmm. yeah, you know, I didn't see enough to, to speak to that, but I mean, I think that he was expecting better for himself. He's got high expectations for himself, but again, at the end of the day, it's time to move forward with his career and focus on what's ahead for him. How good is it to see him perform in these, this game and then as well as the uh, last game after coming back? Yeah, no, again, like I thought he, he responded well. He's not hanging his head down. He's not, I'm sure he's disappointed, but you know, we talked about moving forward and he's moving forward. And I thought he did a good job. Is it a positive sign? Were you happy with the power play plan? You get a goal out of it, and from Terry, who you need it. Uh, well, six on four, so maybe we should start pulling the goalie every power play. <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, it was good response for our guys, and it, it's encouraging that you know, whether it was six on four or five on four, I thought we had a lot of good looks on the power play tonight. We had a couple of chances. Uh, Terry hit a crossbar in the second on the power play, and uh, obviously the goal, you know, any goal in the power play right now we're going to take and, and use for, for our confidence.